Three, two, one. Well, after that amazing introduction, even I'm excited to hear what I've got to say. It's so cold in here, I'm glad we had a warm-up act. So, have we got any farmers here today? I thought so. Well, I hope you enjoyed the food tonight at the comedy club. I certainly enjoyed the meal beforehand. Um, I guess my favourite was the soup. Leek and onion with extra onions. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know that snakes dislocate their jaw so they can eat something really big? I always wondered if that's how opera singers manage to get the top notes. When I'm in the choir, I just love to sing with my eyes shut. Mind you, it does wind up the conductor. <laughs> well, I've had many requests, but I'm still going to sing. <laughs> and I'm really going to hit that top note. <laughs> so, this guy goes into a bar, right? Sorry about that. If there's one thing I really hate, it's bees. The only thing I really hate more is mosquitoes, but thankfully we don't get them here at all, do we? <laughs> well, I don't know about you, but it's hard to stay fit during quarantine, isn't it? The only thing that's been popping out is my hernia. And I actually had a nasty shock when I weighed myself yesterday. That's the problem with electric scales. My wife said I should weigh less. So now I only do it once a week. But my wife said, seriously, you should watch what you eat. So now I've installed security cameras in the kitchen. <laughs> Last week, I went to the doctor with my legs. I had to because the car wasn't working. As I arrived at the surgery, the receptionist went into the consulting room with a pair of glasses. Then she came out and said to me, the doctor can see you now. <laughs> And when I sat down, the doctor said to me, what do you need to watch when you reach 40? I said, the speed cameras. <coughs> but the doctor said, no, you need to lose weight. Did you know you're 80% packaging? <coughs> then I spoke to the doctor about another medical condition I had. And he wrote me a prescription. He said, take this incomprehensible scribble twice a day. <laughs> I actually went to the gym this morning, and one of my friends there said, Did you know, for every hour of exercise you do, you gain an extra two hours of life? I said to him, How old are you? He said, 412. <laughs> my young son was actually with me at the time. I put him on an exercise bike, but he kept saying, Are we there yet? <laughs> it's quite ironic when you think about it, that doing sports isn't always good for your health. My friend had a skiing accident. It was an uphill struggle, and he went downhill very quickly. They say your final memory will be going down a dark tunnel with light at the end of it. Interestingly, that's my earliest memory. 